Jeep Philippines has rolled out the 2025 Jeep Ne Wrangler Rubicon with upgraded features and design tweaks. The 2025 Jeep Ne Wrangler, now available in the country, features 33-inch tires to provide great off-roading capability while still making a good daily driver. Personally, the best feature, feature I like the most about the car is the 33-inch tires, the entire setup of it. So just to make it short, let's say it's 33-inch tires, but so I like it because it's not too small. You get the look that all the clients are going for. So the 33-inch tires is composed of the 285 series tires. So this is actually the maximum width you can fit in the Rubicon without any sort of modification. So you get that look that you want, that beefy, off-road ready look that everyone wants. You get that, uh, but you don't sacrifice the getting into and getting out of the vehicle. So because other clients may go for a 35 inch tires, but that's very specific client set who would really go off-roading. If you have 35 inch tires, it would be very difficult for you to get in and out of the vehicle. And we try to market the Wrangler. We want to make clients like the Wrangler and use them as a daily driver. So the new Jeep Wrangler Rubicon is offered in both two-door and four-door variants and comes with the Off-Road Plus option. So Off-Road Plus mode is actually something new for the Wrangler. It sneakily made its way inside the Wrangler Rubicon a couple of years back. Uh, but officially, it's here with the Wrangler 2024. And basically, the Off-Road Plus mode is sort of a sport mode for off-road cars. Now, when we say sports mode in other vehicles, sports mode usually change how aggressive your engine reacts, how aggressive your traction control is, your shift timing, your throttle response, your pedal response. So that's sort of, in a nutshell, what's going on with an off-road plus. So depending on what mode you're in, so if you're in four high or if you're in four low, the off-road plus will behave differently. So usually, for example, in the four high setting, you actually want better throttle response from your pedal. Versus, for example, if you're going into four low, you actually want that throttle response to be more broader so you can get you to manage the power delivery uh, even better. The SRP for the new Jeep Wrangler Rubicon four-door variant is 5.78 million pesos. The two-door variant goes for 5.59 million pesos. Jeep Philippines has lined up a number of activities to let more people see and learn about the new features in the 2025 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon. The new Jeep Wrangler Rubicon will be going around this September. September 19, we will be having a VIP night at New Star Cebu. September 21, we will be having a driving event at Sevilla Park in Laguna. And September 28, we will be having an off-road clinic at Porak, Pampanga.